and in today's video, um, something very exciting happened. So on February 17th, Star Stable released um, Mobile for Star Stable in the US and a few different countries in Europe. I will tell you guys which countries they are in a second here, but here is some of the game information. It's really exciting, and I'm really surprised Star Stable did not make a bigger deal out of this. They sort of just sprung it on us, but um, I think it, it's a really exciting update. So this is a post from Star Stable's Instagram um, on all the places that the mobile version of Star Stable will be available in. So there are quite a few places that it's available in, but it might take a little while for Star Stable to show up in the app for some of these areas. So... Um, just make sure that you keep checking your app store if it's available in your area. So when I first opened it, it did have to update and I had to log into my account, but this is when I first just started to play. So it sort of gives you a little bit of a um, loading screen just like it does on the desktop version of the game. And then once you get to this screen, it will load a tutorial so it shows you all of the little buttons and things so there's a lot of buttons and it's definitely going to be an adjustment so after this loading screen you'll be taken straight into the game now i was very excited for this update because for a long time i did not have a computer to play star stable on but i still really wanted to play star stable so i think that for all the people who want to play star stable but don't have a computer this will be really exciting for all of them I think it's going to be a bit hard to get used to because of the controls. There's a lot of different buttons to do different things with. And the horse care system, I haven't really figured it out yet. Um, I assumed if you were just going to tap on their head, it would bring up that little screen like it does on desktop. But I'm not sure if I just wasn't doing it correctly or not, but I just dragged and did the horse care like that. So then I attempted to do a race. It was pretty hard, but um, I think that... Over time, I will get much better at controlling my horse on mobile, but um, I think that this update's going to be super helpful for training. So when you're shopping on mobile, it's a little bit different than on desktop. You just hold down on the item and then it will bring up like all the little stats and stuff and then it will show it on your horse as well. So it did take me a little while to figure this out, but to buy it, you just tap on it and it will bring up like the Star Coins or Dwarfix shillings. So then I kind of just played around with all the different little menu things so you can still access like your character sheet your reputation all your stats everything like that that's it for today's video i hope you guys enjoyed and i just wanted to apologize for my inactivity for the past couple weeks and let me know if you guys prefer the mobile version or the desktop version more and i'll see you guys in the next video bye